Well, it's 8 o'clock, and by now I'd have normally been using the internet pretty solidly for a couple of hours. The first thing I do when I wake up is look at my phone, check Twitter, read some emails, then I go online with a, another device and read some news. Uh, I can't do that. I'm giving it all up for the day and relying on face-to-face -face contact and phone calls. It's proving pretty hard at home. Heaven knows what it's going to be like at work. On the tube these days, everybody seems to be looking at a smartphone or a tablet computer. And with Wi-Fi available at stations, I'm finding I'm tweeting every time we stop. Today, I can't do that. I've got to rely on my paper, which already feels hours out of date. The next station is Marble Arch. At work, it's not so much the internet or, or email that I'm missing as, as social media, which is now bound up with everything I do. And I'm not quite sure how to set about my job now without it. It makes life quite relaxing, though. I've been offline now for 18 hours and I'm feeling isolated, disoriented. Is that normal? When we become reliant on something, it's like any sort of dependency. When that thing is taken away from us, we can experience problems with our sense of well-being. Well, what we know in psychology is that um, it's the quality of a human interaction rather than the quantity of human reactions that we have that best predicts our, our sense of connectedness to other people. 86% of Londoners use the internet. That's the highest figure in the UK. So how would they feel if they were asked to give it up? Impossible. Yeah. Why? Um, I don't think there's a day goes by or even an hour goes by that I don't use the internet. That's what we do most of the time. Like someone like me, I use the internet all the time. So if I didn't use the internet, I'd probably be out. What do you miss? Uh, work, uh, email, communication, surfing the net, knowing what's on. Well, my self-imposed exile from the web and social media is nearing an end. It's been really hard. I find it almost impossible to function in the way I normally do. There has been an upside. I've spoken more to colleagues and family, and I even got some piano practice in this morning because I wasn't surfing the web. But overall, I just can't wait to get back online.